Bob Mortimer. Hello! Legendary comedian, average fisherman, and now two-time best-selling author. How has he done that? Well, first, he released his autobiography, Underway, in 2021, and then followed it up in 2022 with this, The Satsuma Complex. The Satsuma Complex is his first novel, and it's a crime fiction novel. I would never usually read crime fiction. There's a few reasons for that. One, I do like a happy story, and crime fiction is, is pretty bleak. And two, I also think that quite often you know what you're gonna get from a crime fiction novel. It's gonna follow an average guy living an average life when suddenly there's a whodunit murder mystery that he gets dragged into and then him and his unlikely gang of associates are the ones who are gonna have to solve it. That's exactly what happens in this book. But what sets this apart from the crime fiction that I personally wouldn't read is that Bob Mortimer's surreal humour and storytelling weaves through every page, making it an accessible and fun story that's added flavour with perspective changes from the main character Gary Fawn to Emily the love interest. We get chapters from both their perspectives. The wider cast of characters are completely nonsensical but all add something to the story. Yeah, I hope they're doing okay now the book's finished. <laughs> and analysis of this book need not go much further than that. It's just a fun ride. It's incredibly funny. Bob himself has said it's basically like a two, three hour version of one of his Would I Lie To You stories. I love that sort of thing. <laughs> it's got all the seasoning of something you'd expect from Bob Mortimer's comedic output while remaining, and I'd hate to over-intellectualize this book, touching, heartwarming, occasionally tear-jerking. And I think it's incredibly rare that you come across a book that doesn't take itself too seriously but has a storyline that is still engaging and heartwarming. It's still got all the elements that you'd expect from a crime fiction book. A genuinely mysterious plotline, intimidating bad guys. It just also happens to have talking squirrels and novelty socks and a complete shithouse leading the investigation. So yeah, that's my brief, biased, but genuine review of the Satsuma Complex by Bob Mortimer. I'd highly recommend it, regardless of your taste in books. I haven't heard the audiobook. I'm sure that's a lot of fun if you're not big into reading. Cheers!